I've looked outside right now. We've got temperatures in the mid 60s, a couple degrees warmer than yesterday, and our winds sustained right now out of the north and west at about 21 miles per hour. So we still have the breeze here through the early evening hours, but I think once the sun sets, those winds back off significantly here overnight tonight and throughout the day tomorrow. We are still quiet and high pressure is going to move in here later on this evening. That will keep us dry and mostly sunny and will calm our winds down here as we go into the day on Wednesday. All clear here tonight. Temperatures managing to make it for everyone in the mid 60s. 64 out in Newton uh, for the 5 o'clock hour. We're at 65 in Ames, 66 right now over in Perry. Over the next three days, things look pretty nice. Tomorrow I think will be picture perfect. Temperatures right at 70. We lose the wind. We have a lot of sunshine, so really nice Wednesday shaping up. It does turn a little bit breezier back on Thursday, but temperatures are into the mid to upper 70s and then the sunshine and the mild weather will stick around as we go into the day on Friday. So winds here tonight slowly die down here and then once we get into the day on Wednesday, we're back to just a light northwest wind uh, sustained between five to 10 miles per hour. So tomorrow will feel a lot better and then that breeze that I mentioned on Thursday, our winds will shift out of the south here and we could see gusts maybe 15 20 miles per hour. Again, nothing crazy with the winds on Thursday, but a little bit of a breeze will help bring in uh, that warm air as we go into the end of the work week. As far as fire weather is concerned, that red flag warning was posted for northern Iowa earlier today. Again, we've had strong gusty winds, but also low relative humidity levels. Those increase, which is good news here overnight tonight and into the day on Wednesday. I, so I think we will lose that threat for fire concerns here heading through the day tomorrow. Temperatures into the 70s, but again, we lose the strong winds and our relative humidity levels really rebound throughout the day tomorrow. So tonight, mostly clear. We'll drop back into the 30s. Could be some patchy frost for some neighborhoods later on this evening. We drop into the low 30s up towards Fort Dodge and Algona, uh, mid 30s out towards places like Grinnell, 38 tonight here in Des Moines. Tomorrow's forecast takes us back to the upper 60s, low 70s. Again, a lot of sunshine here as we go into the day tomorrow and we'll be a little bit above normal for this time of year with highs right around 70 for uh, places like Ames and Des Moines, 71 out in Carroll tomorrow. So eight day forecast looks like this slim rain chances kind of uh, sporadically popped in here, but most of those chances later in the evening through the overnight hours. So I think daytime hours are good. We'll see temperatures back to the mid 70s there on Saturday. Best chance for storms right now looks to be on Sunday. Highs close to 80 degrees for the end of the weekend. And that will continue into the first part of next week.